Hello all, welcome back. Uh, so in our previous video, we have applied different different aug augmentation technique. Okay, so in this video, what I will do, uh, I will uh, uh, like uh, apply some of the pre-processing steps. Okay, uh, in our data set because uh, before giving this uh, data uh, into our model, so we need to apply some of the pre-processing step. Okay, so what are the pre-processing steps? Actually, we need to apply. Let me tell you. Okay, so here uh, one issue you will uh, see here. If I show you the original image, okay, so this is the original image and uh, here if you see there are lots of background okay like this uh, sky is there trees is okay uh, trees are there so like you can see there are lots of like background okay background so this background i don't need okay so what i can do if i can crop this image okay till this point and i if i just only like keep this road okay so it's enough for me okay i don't ha i am not supposed to like keep all the background okay because see whenever you are giving the background your image will be like more complex so whenever it will do the convolution at the time it will be like very difficult okay to collect the features okay because see every background will have different different textures okay and uh, it may get confused okay at that time so better if you just crop this image and if you just keep this road because i only need this road okay because here i am just considering my starting angle okay here i am not considering the uh, like sky trees and all okay so what i can do i can crop these images and i i can only keep this road that's it okay so for that what i will do i will define one uh, function here called image preprocessing okay so guys uh, this is the like you can say function i have defined so it so it will like not only apply like cropping operation and what it will do it will convert your rgb image to uh, yuv format okay yuv color formats why i need yuv color format because the model i'm going to use uh, in this uh, project which is nothing but your nvidia model okay so nvidia model is like a it's a different architecture so guys here you can take different different architecture from cnn okay but you won't be getting like good results okay if i if you are taking resnet inception these are the architecture you won't be getting good results okay so for self driving car actually there is a dedicated model called nvidia model okay it is only made for okay building this kinds of self driving car okay so i'll be using that uh, you can say cnn model okay and this is a little bit complex model you can talk about uh, and this is like one amazing model although it's like very small model but it will work amazing okay it will feel like so this model actually suggests whenever you are giving this kinds of data okay instead of giving as a rgb format just try to convert to uh, yuv format okay so this is like uh, the requirement whenever you will be using nvidia model okay and also you need to apply gaussian blower okay after converting your data uh, like uh, rgb to uh, yuv you need to apply gaussian blower and also you need to resize the image okay in this dimension like 200 and uh, 66 okay so this is the input size okay of the nvidia model okay now after that you need to also scale down your data okay scale down the image basically what i am doing here this is my raw images okay this is my raw array i'm just scaling the array okay divided i'm div i'm just dividing by uh, 255 okay so yes guys these are the pre-processing steps you need to apply throughout your data and here this is the code for cropping the image okay so basically here so image is nothing but word it's just an array okay it has three dimension okay like your uh, height width and chan uh, like you can say channel okay so here basically i'm skipping the channel okay i'm just only considering my height and width okay so see here, here i'm selecting the height as uh, 60 and with as 135 okay 135 here okay basically i'm just cropping till this point okay now let me execute this code it would be very clear so now let's apply so here basically i'm testing on just one image so whenever i will be so whenever i will be uh, writing my batch image okay at that time i will apply this technique okay this preprocessing technique uh, on my whole data okay now here it will return what it will return your preprocessed image now let's visualize it also okay so this is the code uh, to visualize first of all it will uh, like visualize your original image and it will uh, visualize your preprocessed image okay now let me execute see guys this is your original image and this is your preprocessed image okay now just see the changes okay it has cropped the images see so it has cropped this uh, okay it has like removed this background and it has also converted to your yuv color format and it has also applied gaussian blower see this image is a little bit blower okay so now this is the correct format okay for the nvidia model okay so this thing actually you need to apply it is super important guys okay if you are uh, building this kinds of self-driving car okay so so yes guys yeah i think yeah that's it so these are the pre-processing steps you need to apply uh before training your data okay 
so i think i'm done with uh, so in the next video what i will do i'll be writing my uh, batch generator okay because see batch generator is like another important topic uh, i will discuss this thing okay in that in that video so thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you next time